Hello, Timor Leste. My name is Jeremy Schwartz. I am the founder and executive director of World Possible. We are a nonprofit organization that focuses on delivering educational content to the most hard to reach locations digitally. And so these are the locations around the world where internet access is expensive or unreliable or just completely non-existent. But you wanna provide children or school age, um, young adults access to educational content that you know exists online and in digital format, but you can't do it because of lack of connectivity. What we have developed is a product we call RACHEL, which stands for a Remote Area Community Hotspot for Education and Learning. And what we do is we make copies of educational websites. So if you have the national curriculum, we can make a copy of it, or we have Wikipedia or the Khan Academy, which allows students to do interactive exercises in math from all the way from basic arithmetic up through calculus. We have hundreds of websites that we've made copies of, and then we store those copies directly on this device. So this device has a large storage drive inside it. It also has a battery, so it can run for eight hours without power, and it's emitting a wireless signal that you can connect to with any smartphone, tablet, laptop, or desktop computer. And when you connect to this device, you're able to access all of the content that's already stored inside. So if you have a desktop computer lab, but you don't have internet connectivity, or you've got computers and you want to provide educational content, we have taken the best content from around the world, made copies of it, and installed it directly on this device, which we sell for $500 with no recurring fees, no data allowances, none of that kind of thing, because you're not using the internet. You're connecting just to the content that's already inside here. So let me go through and show you a little bit what that content looks like. And this page here shows you exactly what any of your users could see if they had a Rachel device in their school. And it's copies of wonderful world-class resources like Khan Academy, which covers math and science and econ, arts and humanities. From early math, all of these are different topics that have wonderful videos that you can watch. And then students can have exercises that they do. There's a login, they can track their progress. We've got wonderful um, Wikipedia, which is an encyclopedia, a place to upload your own content, uh, world maps, textbooks, wonderful inspirational TED Talks, podcasts, great books of the world, the African Storybook Project, health guides, medical encyclopedias. All of this is content we've made copies of, and you can just pop it into any village, school, rural library, community, and everyone can have free access to this if they have a tablet or a smartphone or a laptop or desktop. None of it requires a data connection. And we've actually had a lot of users from Timor Leste. And so here I'm just going to go ahead and play part of this YouTube video that some of the volunteer deployments have put together. And you'll see here folks are on a variety of de devices. Some are on um, iPads or tablets. Here you've got some on desktop computers. And this is all wonderful places where Rachel exists today. And you can see they're watching Khan Academy videos here and doing the exercises. No internet access required or used, whether it's on the desktop or a smartphone. There's Rachel itself. You just type in the, the local address for Rachel, you connect to it, and you're all set. You're ready to go. You can share files with each other. You can read books. You know, this is really a wonderful resource. You can really have unlimited access to the um, websites that we make copies of, which isn't everything, and it requires a lot of work to make a copy of a website. But for us, it's totally worth it just to provide these educational opportunities to students. And you'll see this is all happening in Timor-Leste. It's happening in Indonesia. It's happening all around the world. Rachel exists in dozens and dozens of countries today for students who don't have access to regular internet who want to still further their educational opportunities. A very quick overview of what Rachel is and what Rachel can do. You know, most of our most successful deployments really take Rachel and they customize the content. So Timor Leste may have a national curriculum that you can digitize and include on this device. This device is, functions just like um, a very small version of the internet. So if there's a website that's out there that you have access to, you can most of the time compress it, put it onto Rachel, and then take this anywhere in the world. Again, it doesn't require internet once it's been set up the very first time with its content. So there's no needs from then on to ever have a data connection or to worry about bandwidth or to limit people's access. You can really go as long and as far as you want with a device like this. It's really a wonderful place in between internet access and nothing.
So with that, I'll turn it over to some questions.